now the next thing that we will do is first we will start from the messages so what we can do is let's close this now come here to the messages area and here we have to display the message area header or you can say the top bar for that we will also now implement the advanced stat management using provider that is the provider stat management and the reason for this is you already know that we have to remember the user on which the user tab from the contact list with whom the logged in user wants to start chatting that is sending messages so first of all let's add the dependency open up your browser go to pub.dev site search for provider which is this one provider click on installing and copy this come back to the project and simply add that here provider click on pub get and it has been added successfully so now we can use the provider stat management now click ignore and now right click on lib new create a new folder and we will give it name as provider right click on provider new dot file and we will give it name as provider underscore chat class provider chat with change notifier user model and this is to user data we will give it this name to it user model get to user to user data let's add underscore with it in order to make it private okay when you add underscore with a variable it becomes private also with this one okay as it is that is the user data is accessible by this to user we will give it name as to user data it will be public and then we can say to user data user let's give it name as user data model user data model and we will assign the to user data model to our We'll assign this to our underscore to user data and then we will notify the listeners so now in here in our messages area above the return container here we can say user model to user data context dot watch watch the chat provider dot to user data which is assigned to to user data so now here you will add a condition that is to user data if the to user data if that become equals to null then display this container okay which is the whatsapp image background otherwise if the to user data not equals to null then else column widget that is inside this column widget we will display the header for the chat area or you can say for the messages area basically 
so let's implement that we can say children widget let's add a color to this container the color will be default colors dot bar bar background color apply padding from all side it and then inside this row first we will display the circle avatar background color will be gray and that person profile image we have to display so it is by the name image now after the circle avatar we will display some space and then that username font size will be 16 after this we will add spacer widget that is after displaying the profile image the name we will have spacer that is this will be at the left side of the header and then after spacer comes the right side of the header so we will just display an icon at the right side After this icon, let's display another icon. So this is our header. We'll write here a comment header or you can set top bar. After that, we have to display the messages so for now we will add here a comment that is messages list of course which we are implementing step by step 